Hi guys, this is Carl Rush at New York Sports and Spinal Physical Therapy in Scottsdale, New York. Today we're going to go over the three best strengthening exercises in order to prevent ACL tears. So the three best strengthening exercises to do for your ACL prevention. The first one's going to be a step down exercise. So what you're going to do, hands on your hips. Look straight in front of you. Your goal is to take your injured leg or the leg you want to work and that's the leg that stays on the step. The other leg you want to tap your toes or your heel, it does not matter, to the floor as uh, slowly as possible and well controlled. And it looks like that. What you're going to see, especially for those who are having a hard time with their stability in their leg, is as you go down you're going to see this dynamic valgus or caving in of the knee. That's a very important because that's the mechanism that the ACL tears. So we want to be able to control that. Now, how many sets of reps are we going to do? Sure, you could do two sets of 10, 15. You hear those numbers all the time. What you want to focus on is your control, your form, and just go to fatigue. If at any point it becomes easy, you could just increase the height of the step. So once again, just a gentle tap. None of this should ever hurt. The next exercise, what controls that caving in of the knee is not just your quadricep, which is a common muscle seen in the front of the knee, it's also looking at your hip musculature. So next we're gonna work on a hip slash core exercise, in which case you are gonna be doing a side plank position. You're allowed to rest your hand on the floor for support, and with your legs in line, you're gonna lift one leg straight up in the air, making sure that you don't kick forward or twist and turn back. It's just straight up and down, working once again to fatigue and working on both sides. The last exercise is not just a regular strengthening technique. It's learning how to jump with proper technique. It's very important. Because you could be the strongest person in the world. If you jump incorrectly, you still put yourself at risk for injury. So whether you're jumping up on a box or coming down from into a landing position, you want to once again avoid that collapsing in of the knees. This is best done in front of a mirror and just done with control. So the first one, making sure you have a nice equal stance, jumping on nice lightly onto your toes, and then same thing, landing on your toes on the way down. Nice soft landing. What's going to happen, you put yourself at injury if you're going to land with a stiff leg. So, no landing stiff, no landing stiff. You want to get a nice bend in those knees to unload those forces. So lastly, once again, through repetition, jumping up. Jumping down, nice and controlled. Thank you.